Okay, there we are. Stepper motor to drive the focuser on the ED80T. Mount it up. This little bracket goes from the base of the focuser itself over to the motor. A collar there to tie everything together to the focuser shaft. Got some wrapped up wires here. A little connector to be able to disconnect things when we put it away at night. Over here to the board itself. Just a Arduino and Easy Driver board and an old high tech servo case that I had laying around. And we come over here to our SGP software. And we see we're connected to the SGL ASCOM focuser. Uh, I've calculated 86 steps per millimeter, which would give us uh, 47.65 to get out to 55 millimeters which is where the, the ED80 usually likes to start, roughly somewhere in there to be focused. So we're going to go ahead and pull up the control panel here. We're on focus. We're going to tell it first, we're going to see that it's at position zero, which is true. At position zero, it's wrapped all the way in. And our little diagram shows us that here. And we're going to tell it to go to, and we're going to give it the position that we had said earlier of 47.65. Tell that OK. And the focuser is moving. And it should come out here to 55 millimeters. If we've done this right, stops right there on 55, just like it ought to. And we said it was 86.64 steps per millimeter. So if we want to move 10 millimeters, we're going to go 866.4. So let's do 866. And if we move in 866, that should move us into right about 45 millimeters. And the focuser moved, and sure enough, right there at 45 millimeters, just like it ought to be. And you'll notice that our little visual here has changed. We're not all racked all the way in. We're at position 3899. And now if we want to park it, we can zero the focuser. And we should see the focuser rack all the way back in and stop right at the zero position and it does. So there you go. The SGL Arduino powered focuser.